cannot find a person who can do it. You it's will. impossible. You there will. is not a, a you, person who can fulfill everything. You will when you see evidence in front of you. If I tell you find it, I will make it worse for you. Watch people who are at peace together. Just watch them. Don't ask them to tell you how to do it. Just look at them. A person who wants to be with somebody, they need to be useful. If they're not useful, if they're not giving you anything, they will say, what is the point of being with you? If you are in a relationship with somebody and you're everything and the person is nothing, why do they stay with you? It's for all, I'm talking to all of us, by the way, so don't feel it's directed on it. To, to really have a relationship, you have to experience humility. That's the hardest part in life. It's humility associated with, you feel that everything's taken away from us. There's a shame being around this. But this is the moment when you heal, when somebody see you like this. And this is actually what happened to the baby when the baby's born, crying, shitting himself, doing everything. The mother never said to the baby, why you make yourself dirty? Does she? She's there, not even thinking how to change the child. She's just doing it. And until the mother starts getting nervous and angry later in life. And that's what we need. Unfortunately, the time we live in, this is only available in therapy. We go to therapy for this. But I, what I don't like about therapy is we have to pay the therapist. Because we buy it. But it's inevitable because they need to live. Have you noticed something? I am not talking to you the same way I talk to him. Why? I am not fighting with you, I'm fighting with you. There's an energy there different than energy here. Why is that? I think maybe he, if he, you can answer that. I feel I'm like a warrior. I don't know why. How come I am responding to you this way and I'm responding to him in a different way? Why is that? I don't know, because I... May I provoke you? And you provoke him because he is resisting you? I'm not resisting you? I feel he wants to save me in a way I, I cannot accept. Yes, Great. yes. Mm -hmm. This is what you're doing to the people. <laughs> exactly what you're doing to the people, what I'm doing to you. And he's in a very privileged position. He can see us. And I can never convince him. So you are mirroring, in fact, uh, him say yes. I am mirroring, I become like you. Yeah. So you know from yourself best, because otherwise you cannot mm -hmm. mirror him. So this is a part of you that has been healed in order to mirror him? Uh, uh, possibly. You see, um, someone rich and successful are very difficult to help. Because you're better than me, how can I help you? You, you are in a very interesting position. And if I wouldn't have become rich, yes. how could you help me? No, this is, this is an assumption we make. I'm not saying I'm better or you're better. Yes, I know. But you have become superior. You will not accept help from someone less than you. Actually, I think we touched on something very interesting because I, I am started to mirror you a lot when we're talking. And I'm pushing and you're pushing back, you see. But there's a dynamic and he can see it because he's outside of us. Easier for him to see it. And being in his profession, he can see it more, of course. Your energy is very powerful. And any change can what happen with power. Yes, you can buy a house, you can build apartments, you can build a hotel, yes. But when it comes to the soul of us, it cannot change with power, like love. Love cannot come with power. I never once was at peace with me to see a person. 
a real person. And this is what we're doing with people. We don't have the courage to see people as they are.